Side note, I always want to be the hero of something because growing up I saw the Spider-Man movie. Spider-Man, or Peter Parker, he's just a regular guy and he gets to rescue people who, you know, need help, like old women, which comes to play in this situation. I was outside yesterday and across the street I saw an old woman. Elderly folk are usually like stereotypically the people that, you know, need help. I was just thinking of awful things that could happen to her. Maybe maybe someone would like run up and like try to stab her with a knife, a sword, or a, a banana. Like a group of kids would like walk up to her and start like messing with her and then I could just swoop in and be like, hey guys, stop! And then they'd like beat me up or something. I'm thinking of all this just so I can save her, so I can like feel important or that I'm a good person. And being heroic or brave is not me at all. I am the complete opposite of that, so why would I even want to be something that I am not even? An old man fell right in front of me once, and instead of calling for help, I kind of like, I kind of just, I just looked at him. His body is right in front of me, and I just kind of like backed off, looked at it, started to kind of wander away, and then I started to like feel bad, and then I finally called for help. The first thing that I should have done, I did it last. I don't think this stems from me being a bad person. I don't want to be a bad guy. I want to be the hero. I think it's just that I'm just awkward. I'm just awkward is the answer to every problem with my life. Why did I stop texting her? I'm just awkward. If you and I ever meet in public, please don't expect for me to respond confidently. Expect the response you would get from saying hi to a stranger. Because the difference between me and you is that you know me. I have a whole chan- I have a whole video library of me just talking. She, you know, like, brings out, you know, me. I don't- I don't know what I'm, what I'm saying is I make videos and most of you don't. I don't know you like you know me because if you've been subscribed to me for a while, you've seen all you've seen all angles. It makes me wonder if people notice famous YouTubers on the street and like it's just extremely awkward between both of them. I think that's something that people do. Like I'm pretty sure like Ryan Higa or Ray William Johnson will like sometimes be stopped on the street so like so I don't know someone could take a picture of them. I don't think that's something that I can handle. If a subscriber met me, this is how it would go. Hey Josh! I don't know the moral of this video because I usually don't have a moral to any of my videos. I'm just here to say that if there's ever a robber in a bank, he's like, you, you, and you. Uh, get over here, I'm going to shoot you if you and you don't open the vault. Like that kind of situation, if you ever see me just like stand up, please stop me because I wouldn't know what I'm doing at all. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. As in like, if you're watching right now, just hold it thumbs up to your screen, because that's that's all I want. I just want you to hold your thumbs in front of the screen. That's like, that's just how I get, you know, in the mood for, um, for being judged. <laughs> Good joke, Josh. Good joke. That's the best joke I made up all day. All right, bye.